Hello everyone and welcome to the video. In this video we will be learning about X-ray circuits. Now the X-ray circuit composed of three parts that is primary circuit which is known as low voltage circuit. Then we have the secondary circuit which is known as high voltage circuit and finally we have the filament circuit. Now in this image you can see the X-ray circuit here the part shown in red color that is the primary circuit, the part shown in blue color that is the secondary circuit and the part shown in green color that is the filament circuit. Now if, if you observe the red color region we can see that the primary circuit starts from the source of the alternating current up to the primary coil of the step up transformer. Okay now in this primary circuit, you will find devices such as the main switch, the auto transformer, KVP selector, exposure switch and exposure timer. All these parts, they are present inside the operating console except the primary coil of the step up transformer which is present outside the operating console. So the primary circuit, it is a circuit that extends between the source of alternating current up to the primary coil of the step up transformer. Now it is the primary circuit that uh, provides the power supply for both secondary as well as the filament circuit. The auto transformer present in the primary circuit is the source of power for both secondary as well as the filament circuit. Now the part shown in blue color that is the secondary or the high voltage circuit now here you can find a step up transformer. The function of step up transformer is to convert low voltage to high voltage. Now this step up transformer is connected to a rectifier. The function of rectifier is to convert alternating current to direct current. The rectifier is finally connected to the x-ray tube. Now you can learn more about transformers, types of transformers, rectifiers and types of rectification in my videos. So I shall put the link in my description box. Kindly go to the description box and get the link and try to watch the video so that this portion will be little more easier. Now the high voltage circuit um, here the current flows in the circuit only during the exposure time okay not only that the high voltage circuit is a is considered to be a dangerous circuit because of the high voltage and because of that the cable that is being supplied to the x-ray tube has to be highly insulated because high voltage is being carried out by these cables the third one is the filament circuit in filament circuit you will find a rheostat and a step down transformer this transformer is known as filament transformer now the function of filament transformer is to supply power to the cathode filament so as to produce heating of the cathode filament and thereby facilitate thermionic emission for producing electrons so the power source for the primary of the step down transformer comes from the auto transformer Again, in the secondary circuit also, the power for the step-up transformer comes from the auto transformer. That is why I said it is a primary circuit that provides or that acts as a source of power for both secondary as well as the filament circuit. Now, come to the filament circuit. You can see the step-down filament transformer. Its primary is also connected to the auto transformer. The secondary is connected to the cathode end of the x-ray tube. Now, in the filament circuit, I said that we are using step down transformer. That means here the primary will have more number of turns compared to secondary. That means in primary, there will be 10 to 20 times more turns compared to secondary coil. Also, the voltage across primary will be around 100 to 200 volt, whereas the voltage across secondary is only about 10 volts. So, these are all the different circuits. The, uh, present in the x-ray circuit so we have learned what is primary circuit what is secondary circuit and what is filament circuit 
Now the filament circuit it is activated only when the operator adjusts the milliampere on the generator. Now the purpose of filament circuit is to supply the current so as to heat the x-ray tube filament. The purpose of secondary circuit is to provide direct current to the x-ray tube. The source of primary circuit is to act as a power, uh, source of power for both secondary as well as the filament circuit which is connected to the x-ray tube. So these are the different parts of the x-ray circuit. Thank you so much for watching. If you find this video useful, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.